Welcome to Cam Look, your daily dose of the Cincinnati Art Museum. Each weekday, a staff member or volunteer will share an object from the permanent collection and post questions for the discussion. Check back every day at 10 a.m. for a new work and a new conversation. Hi, I'm Helen, a docent at the Art Museum. Today, I'd like to share with you a Japanese woodblock print that captures for me the quiet dawn after a snowstorm. It's by the samurai artist Utagawa Hiroshige, who during his lifetime was known as the artist of rain, snow, and mist. That's because he so accurately depicted the season, which is a important subject in Japanese painting for over 1,000 years. Clear weather after snow at Kamayama, 1832, is from Hiroshige's iconic series, the 53 stations of the Tokaido. Snow clings to the pine trees lining the road and blankets the slope leading up to the guard tower. Among all the tints and shades of grays, there's just the faintest touch of red above the lower left hills to indicate its dawn. Unfortunately, red is an impermanent or fugitive color and fades over time, as in this old print. There must have been a lot of wind during the previous night's storm. The rock walls below the tower and the distant hills are all plastered with snow. Does it make you shiver? But today the sky is clear, a marvelous blue, heralding a bright, sunny day. That blue is repeated in the coats of three men trudging up the hillside. Who would be out so early? It could be a wealthy wholesaler who supplied the castle's provisions from silk to swords. Perhaps it's during the New Year's holidays when it was a tradition for merchants and craftsmen to visit the governor of the area, the daimyo, who lived in the castle, when they'd exchanged gifts before renewing contracts for the coming year. A major feature of the Japanese art of haiku, three-line, 17-syllable poems, is a reference to the seasons. A haiku by the poet Shiro, 1642-1712, captures the mood of this quiet, simple print. Dawn. The storm is buried in the snow. Kameyama was Station 46, a major castle town on the highway that connected the shogun's capital, Edo, with the emperor's capital, Kyoto. Below, we see the steep roofs of snow-covered houses that lined a Tokaido. This was the Jokomachi, or undercastle town, where commoners, shopkeepers, and minor samurai lived. The highway was lined with shops, inns, and workshops for over a mile. After the storm, people were probably gathered around their fires, happy to be inside and warm. I visited Kameyama and found an extensive model of the town as it existed in the 1800s. Fortified castle, large estates for wealthy samurai, the crowded town below, and rice fields. The castle was destroyed in the Anzai earthquake of 1854, the same year that Commodore Perry began treaty negotiations with the shogun. In the center of the photo is the hill that Hiroshige featured in his composition. Yes, if you look closely, you'll see that Hiroshige exaggerated the slope of the road a little bit. He created the marvelous diagonal that sweeps across the print and gives a pleasing balance to the dawn sky and the snowy hillside town and trees. I like the use of artistic license. Would you like to travel back in time? The local government has preserved about a half mile of the old Tokaido Highway in the town of Seki, Station 47. There are shops, a museum, and a restored inn, as close as possible to what they were in the 1830s. When I walked there in 2010, it was a hot July day, just like when Hiroshige walked the Tokaido and sketched its famous sights. Thanks for joining me on Cam Look today to savor a snowy scene at Kameyama or Turtle Mountain in English. Do you like to go out early in the morning after it snows? How would you capture that beauty? Would you use watercolors, ink and brush, oil paints, or a photograph? 
Would you emphasize an urban scene or country landscape? What do you see when you look at your window at snow? I hope it's beautiful.